What's going on? It's another day. We're not on the road today. I am in my front room today. Slightly different video. I'm going to take you guys on a journey. We're going to Cadwell Park. <laughs> now, this was my last track day at Cadwell Park. This was the end of June. So, I think the 28th of June. Went with a couple of my boys. Went with Adam, Liam, Alex and Big Fred. Now, the only ones that were in the novice group, like myself, was myself and Alex on that blue jigsaw. And the other boys were all in the intergroup. Now, this was actually my last track day in the novice group at Cadwell Park. Because for some reason, on that day, everything just clicked like pow, 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 pow. It's time to level up. So, like I said, that was my last novice day. Now, I have been meaning to move up because I do ride with like a couple of my boys and they have seen me on track and they've said, look, it's time to level up. But I've always had it in the back of my mind that, you know what, I'm not quite there yet. But this day at Cadwell showed me that. So I've done quite a few track days in the UK, especially this year. I've done Snetterton, I've done Bedford, Autodrome, I've done Brands Hatch Indy, I've done Donington Park and I've done Cadwell Park. Now, out of all the tracks, they're all great tracks. I love them all. But Cadwell Park is a, it's like a whole new world. It's such a physically demanding track. It's such a technical track and all of that stuff. But I love that track so much, man. I think if it's not my favourite track, then my favourite will be Donington. If Donington's not my favourite, it'll be Cadwell. I don't know, man. Snetterton used to be my favourite, but I'm kind of bored of it now, to be honest, man. I've done it so many times. It's just like, yeah, Snetterton again. But yeah, man. Um, so yeah, like I said, this one's a little bit different. Taking you guys on a journey. And if you lot want to see the rest of my track days, I will vlog them. Now, I didn't film, I wasn't filming for my vlog when I done this track day. But I did have my GoPro active. So I'll bring you on a session. I think when I got the footage was the third session. Because all the other sessions, the GoPro, I don't know what the GoPro was on. It filmed for a minute, filmed for two minutes and then cut out. But this session, third session, it went throughout the whole session. So you lot will catch that anyways. So yeah, man, pretty much that's it. Let me look, let me know what you lot think about the video. Um, as some of you know, those who do know me and those who follow my Instagram and stuff, you do know that I've completely stopped riding the roads and I've focused all my time and effort and energy and money and everything else on the racetrack because that's where you can really really ride your bike man i've been riding the roads for a lot of years now but slowly over the past few years i've been phasing out not really going for rides and all of that but i think this year is when i really kicked my track game into high gear so throughout the year i'm quite pleased with the progress and getting up from the novice group stepping up into the intermediate if anything that's I'm, I'm very very happy with that man so yeah man let me know what you lot think anyways down in the comments hit me up um and then yeah man track days let's go where we at where we at come on yeah boy yeah boy come on Some flames, bruv! Little ones, little ones! <laughs> it's all flamed out today, man!
Are you saying Giza? Yeah. 